Take notes as you watch this video and take the quick quiz at the end. Imagine an environment where every creature, plant and element is connected in a delicate web of interdependence. This is the essence of an ecosystem, a complex network of living organisms interacting with their physical environment. By organizing these ecosystems into distinct levels, scientists unravel the mysteries of nature and understand how these intricate systems sustain life. Let's delve into a pond ecosystem, a microcosm teeming with life and activity to explore these levels. First, we have the individual, like a single frog. This level focuses on the characteristics and behaviours of one organism, how it survives and its role in the larger system. Next is the population level, encompassing all individuals of the same species in the ecosystem. In our pond, it's not just one frog, but all frogs together. They breed, compete and thrive as a group, influencing their species' future in the pond. Then we broaden our scope to the community level. Here, various populations interact. There are populations of frogs, ducks, fish, aquatic plants, insects, and more. This level highlights the diversity of life forms and their relationships, like predation, competition, and symbiosis. The ecosystem level brings in the non-living elements – water, soil, air and sunlight. In the pond ecosystem, these elements are as crucial as the living organisms. They provide the essential components for life, like nutrients, oxygen and habitat. At each level, from the individual frog to the entire ecosystem, every element plays a vital role. The frog, for instance, is a predator and prey, a breeder and a consumer of resources. It interacts with its environment, contributing to the nutrient cycle and maintaining the delicate balance of the pond. This balance is critical. Changes in the ecosystem, like pollution or climate shifts, can disrupt this harmony, affecting every level from individual frogs to the entire pond community. By studying these levels, individual, population, community and ecosystem, we gain insights into how life thrives and adapts. OK, let's see what you've learned. Time for a quick quiz.
Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Don't forget to subscribe!